Recomposition is not magic. It is a process confirmed by dozens of scientific studies that really works if you follow a few key conditions. And today, I will show you how to do it correctly, without extremes, without miracle diets, and without losing strength. At the end of this video, I will tell you three smart principles of recomposition. So watch until the end. It works best in three cases. If you are new to training, if you have returned after a break, if you have 20% or more body fat, then you your body is literally renewed. It is again sensitive to training, reacts faster to protein, and burns fat more easily. If you have been training for a long time, the process will be slower, but still possible. And even in a dry form, 12 to 15% fat, recomposition is real. It just requires more patience, discipline, and accuracy. When recompositioning, weight is not an indicator. You can become lighter, but look bigger, because fat disappears faster than muscle grows. It is better to focus on the mirror, the centimeter, and strength indicators. If your waist decreases and your strength increases, you are on the right track. Don't make the mistake of the majority. Don't switch to endless cardio circuits. Your body burns fat through nutrition and grows muscles through training. Therefore, the basis is strength exercises in the range of 6 to 12 repetitions, progressive load, and control of technique. Your goal is to give your muscles an incentive to grow, even in a deficit. And be sure to keep protein at 2.2 to 3 grams per kilogram of dry mass. This is your insurance against muscle loss. Sleep? Yes, the same dream. This is not just rest. This is the moment when your body really grows. Eight hours of quality sleep equals more growth hormone, better metabolism, and faster fat burning. Recomposition is proof that you don't have to choose between burning fat and gaining muscle. You can have both. And here are your promised three principles of recomposition. Sensible nutrition, exercise, and rest.